Hello, this is Will Faber from Art to Ride, and today I want to talk about, once again, one of the most important aspects of training. You know, especially when we're, our training is interrupted. Particularly here in California, we get rain days, and once it rains here, we have very few indoor arenas, so it usually takes a few days to um, get the rings back in shape. So, on a day like this today, I only have these round pens, or lunging pens rather, um, to work in. But what's most important with every horse every day is simply that we get him into the zone. Now you can see with this young horse, now he came out quite fractious this morning after being in the stall for a couple of days. Excuse me, I'm doing this one-handedly. And, uh, and he bucked around a little bit, which of course I disciplined him for. We never want to let horses buck. You know, we don't want to let horses buck it out because they're going to think you're going to let them buck it out when they're on their back. So, you know, when you have a horse bucking, you just say no and send them on forward until they stop bucking. But what we're looking for every day, my point here, is to get the horse into the zone where it just stretches and relax and all the outside things, like it's blowing, the wind is quite uh, heavy right now, there's horses walking by, which upset this horse a lot in the very beginning. But after only a few minutes, he settled right out down into this beautiful stretching trot and away he went to work. So this is what we need to achieve with every horse every day. This is the most important aspect of training that we get. That is that complete relaxation of the horse's body and his mental attitudes where he's actually pliable and willing to do what we want. And he's learning that this is a work skill. That is, he's learning a work ethic. Oh, the sooner I get to this, the sooner I'm done. And that's what we want them to learn. So this is where we're looking for. So if your horse has had some days off or some time off, or you have, you know, you can't ride in your regular arena, this is what you want to get to every day, you know. Very often people stop before they get to this stage. And of course, they're never gonna to get to the stage if you're beating them up or you know they're in uncomfortable frames. This only works if you're putting the horse in the most uncomfortable frame. Now notice I have no side range on this horse or anything and how beautifully he stretches into that contact with the bridle. So I send him on a little bit there. Once again, I'm doing this one-handedly this morning. So you get the idea of what I'm talking about. So that's what we're looking for every day to get the horse into the zone where he's completely relaxed. And then we go on a little bit, use that work a little bit, and then we stop before the horse becomes exhausted. And that should be sort of our game plan every day with training horses. Hope that helps. This is Will Faber from Archer Ride.